Hi, my name is Sunday. In this video, I'll be talking about warnings to those traveling to Africa, ban on flight return possibility. So, to those ones that are traveling to Africa, especially in this Christmas period, many people just want to travel to Africa for visits and other things. Please, there's warning that is going out there. There's possibility of flight return ban. You might travel there, but it will become difficult for you to come back. Many people have been asking questions. Is there going to be lockdown again in Europe or in other countries, especially in here in Italy? At the moment, at the moment, there's no possibility of lockdown. The government is still looking into it. Just some countries that are locking down their country. But at the moment, majority of the country, they are not going back into lockdown. But there's possibility of flight ban. Those ones that are coming from Africa because of the new thing, the new COVID-19 variant that have been discovered in South Africa and also some other African countries as well. Currently, many EU countries have started banning flight from South Africa and six other countries from Africa. So those ones traveling to other parts of the world in Africa, other parts of the countries in Africa, like Nigeria, Ghana, and other places, you guys should also be on alert as well. Because this new variant that is happening now in South Africa and some parts of Africa countries back there in certain region of Africa, those people their flights have been banned from coming over to Europe and other countries as well, even to America and other places. So those ones that are in Nigeria that have traveled back to Nigeria, planning to travel to Nigeria, should please be warned. This variant might just happen in Nigeria if they discover it in Nigeria as well, or in Ghana or West Africa. Any flights from Nigeria or any flights from West Africa, they can also ban it as well. So you guys should be at on alert. That is it. If you are traveling to Africa, please be warned. And those ones that are traveling just to go and celebrate. This period we have, this period we have, is a period of emergency. Not to go and show off. If you know there's a thing that you want to go and do there, that thing can be postponed. The next year, next two years, it is better you do. This is an advice to everyone. It's good traveling back home to pay visit, especially this Christmas period. It is good, but if you know that those things can be postponed, it is better you do because the emergency period we have now, if anything happened, just like what happened back in 2020, many people traveled back to Africa, especially Nigeria, to celebrate Christmas with their family and all that is, it is good. Many of them, on their surprise, without them knowing, lockdown came and many flights were banned. Many were unable to return back. Some, through the help of social media and all that, they were able to return back by going through other countries to go and travel, especially Cotonou and others. Many did not know about it. Those ones that know about it, they were able to quickly leave. But some that did not know about it, till now, some of them have heard about some people. Till now, their resident permit expired. They were unable to come back. And till now, some of them are still blocked back home. They are unable to come over back to where they were working or residing before in Europe or in other countries. So that is it. So those ones that are still planning to go, except that thing is emergency, except that thing so important, then there's no other thing you need to do, you need to go. And if you have gone already, you are listening to me right now, you have gone already, please be on alert. If they discover it in Nigeria or Ghana, that COVID-19 variant that is happening in South Africa, it is called Omicron. If Omicron is discovered in Nigeria because they said it's deadly and others, if it's discovered, if they are not some quickly, more than wrong or more. If you know that you are residing here in Europe or you are residing here in America, wherever you are, please, you can quickly change your flight before once they discover it. It's not going to take a week before they will ban any flight coming from that country. That is it. Any country that is being discovered, that they find out that it has happened in that place or it's happening in that place, those flights or any flight from that country will be banned. So those ones traveling to Africa in this period, to Nigeria, if you know you can't cancel your flight, I'm not saying that you go and cancel your flight. It has not happened in Nigeria, but as far as it is happening right now in South Africa, happening in other African countries, up to about six, seven countries, there's possibility he might also get to that place. And when he gets to that place, 
any flight coming from that place will also be banned as well so be on alert be on alert you have traveled back home be on alert you are planning to travel back home you be warned so that is you be warned in traveling there so that is it so these are the six countries that have been banned entry into eu and other countries as well it says in the meantime some countries have decided to introduce measures to avoid import import of that variant the united kingdom has already taken heart on closing the borders to cis africa countries closing their border to cis africa countries in addition to south africa flights from namibia lesotho eswatini zimbabwe and Botswana have been suspended so this flight they have been suspended anybody that is there those people are stuck in that place so that is it so those ones that are still at the end, planning to travel back home, please be warned. In Italy, they say the Omicron variant, the variant has arrived in Italy, the first case in Campania. So they have brought it all over from that side. As far as Italy is concerned, the Health Minister Roberto Speranza announced that he had signed a new ordinance. So they have already signed the ordinance already, which forbids entry into Italy. Anyone anyone who has been in south africa lesotho Botswana, zimbabwe mozambique namibia eswatini in the last 14 days whoever that have been in all this country the person can't enter italy now like i said if you get to other place that are still a safe zone right now nigeria ghana and other place if they also discover it in that place I'm telling you, it's not going to take a week before they're also going to ban any flights in that place. So this video is not just to put fear in your heart, but it's a warning to people that are about to travel there. And for those ones that have traveled back to West Africa, Nigeria, Ghana, and other places, to be on alert. Be on alert. If you hear it, they announce it that they have discovered it in that place. So if you want to do anything about it, you got to quickly do something about it. We know what happened before. We know what happened in 2020 to so those ones that were locked down back in Africa. They were unable to come to renew their resident permit or to continue their job. So their families are here. They were locked down in Africa. So you got to think about what happened in 2020. So for the lockdown that people are thinking about at the moment, there's nothing like lockdown here in Italy or here in Europe. So that is it. So it's only some few countries like Austria that is going into lockdown. Austria has gone into lockdown. So who knows? But at the moment, Italy is not thinking about that one. That's why they have introduced what is called Super Great Pass. Super Great Pass. In another video, we're we'll talking about that. What it means and those people that can make use of it and people who can't do without Super Green Pass. So that is it. So in this video, it's just all about the warnings to those ones that are planning to travel to Africa countries. And for others that are there already, for them to be on alert. In case they are not seeing that they have found it in wherever they are, they should quickly board any flight in returning back. So thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Please like, comment, and also share it to others as well. If you know you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, please do. Subscribe and make sure you click the notification bell. So whenever I upload any new videos or information, you will know. Thank you and God bless you. Bye.